Alright, and hey you guys, it is Caroloni and I'm back with another video. I know you guys probably realized that I've been gone for quite some time. I think the last time I up uploaded a video was about May. And I think that last video was about me getting like a cat and dog and stuff. But things have changed. This is a life update video if you can't tell by the title. So basically May 14th or May 13th, one of those, I found out that I was pregnant. Yeah, I have a few clips that I recorded like when I found out I was pregnant and I have a few clips like when I got my first ultrasound which was exactly at seven weeks and three days. That's really it. I haven't really done any update videos basically tracking my pregnancy or anything. I was really scared because I didn't want to post that I was pregnant and then end up having a miscarriage. So I never really like announced an, on my channel that I was pregnant, just you know, f friends and family knew about it. Not really like everybody else, like my social media life basically. But I am currently 26 weeks and um, six days. I'm about to be 28 weeks tomorrow, which is gonna be Saturday. We are in November. I am recording this, I believe November, 18. I will be doing like separate videos talking about my first trimester, second trimester, and third trimester. Right now, like I said, this is strictly just a life update video. Me updating you guys on my life and currently like what's going on and all of that. Like I was saying, I found out that I was pregnant um, May 13th or May 14th, one of those. And the way I found out was super funny. I don't even think that's something I'm going to like post and tell everybody like how I found out because it's actually very 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 embarrassing but yeah basically had my boyfriend go to Dollar Tree I was not suspecting that I was pregnant but we were about to participate in some things and the person in the video kept advising you know take a pregnancy test take a pregnancy test take a pregnancy test so I was just like why does he keep saying this whatever he's just gonna run a Dollar Tree Grab a couple, you know, dollar pregnancy tests and we'll see. Really, when I was taking it, I was not expecting anything. Like, honestly, there was nothing that I was expecting. Because, honestly, I was about to start my menstrual cycle. And um, usually around, like, the time my menstrual cycle is about to start, I get symptoms of, like, feeling sick and cramping. And, well, not really cramping because I don't really get cramps, but... You know, just like the feeling in your stomach when you're about to start your menstrual cycle. I usually get that feeling. Sometimes I feel like a little bit nausea, but that that's normal to me. Those are the symptoms I get when I'm about to start my menstrual cycle. And my appetite picks up just a tiny bit. But needless to tell, the symptoms and stuff that I was feeling, I didn't really like take into my like, oh, I'm pregnant. I was just thinking more so like, oh, my menstrual cycle is about to start in a few days that's really all I really thought about it but no took the test did the little dropper thingy put it inside the test waited a few didn't really pay attention to it at all after I did the dropy thingy and um I waited a few minutes or seconds it came up as pos it came up as negative but positive like it was very 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 faint. I have a video that I'll insert. But it was very faint. It was like, I couldn't really tell if it was positive or negative. And just so happened, we had got more than one pregnancy test from Dollar Tree. So just so happened, I still had some urine left inside of the little dropper. So I put um, I opened up another one, literally like a coincidence. I opened up another one and I dropped the rest of it inside of that one, came up positive. I was sitting on the toilet like, but I was just sitting there staring at it on the toilet and I was just like, maybe it's broken, maybe it's not right. No, I took some more, I think I took like four. I have them in my bathroom still. Um, I took like two more, they came out positive. My boyfriend was in the room, I was in the bathroom. I was like, Brody. And he came in there and I was like, I'm pregnant. Like, oh my God, we looked at it, it was positive. 
So that same night, we waited until I had to use the bathroom again. He went to the store and he bought a digital one, a clear blue digital one that says pregnant or not pregnant. You guys, I'm pregnant. Oh wait, it won't focus. How do you feel? Excited. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna show the other tests because I took like five tests from Dollar Tree. Yeah, it's like one, two, three, four, five. And then he got a digital one to make sure. And it says pregnant. It says pregnant. The next day, I woke up, called my doctor's office, made an appointment, went in, confirmed that I was pregnant. Um, I found out I was pregnant around four weeks. Literally, they had me come into the doctor like the next day. So yeah, I have a video of the paper too, so I'll post that as well. Went in, they asked me like the last day of my menstrual cycle. I remembered everything. I knew what my due date was going to be already. I knew that it was going to be close to my birthday. They did the estimate of when I was due. I was right. After that, we scheduled another appointment to do, you know, draw blood and all of that stuff and then do a vaginal ultrasound. Mm -hmm. Let me do this. And what we'll do is a quick measurement. This is called the yolk sac. That's a normal part of pregnancy development. Okay. I'm going to turn that wand to the side, honey. Okay. Okay. And I got it angled down. You doing okay? Yeah. Okay. That's heart activity right here. See this little pump? Yeah. Yeah. So we'll get that. We don't listen to it. We just measure it. Okay. Okay. So we won't hear it today, but as you get further along, you will. When your doctor listens with it, what's called a Doppler. Okay. And it's just one this time, right? One. I just see one. Okay. We'll go all the way through. Let's make sure. I was seven weeks and three days. I'll show you each of these, like, pictures of the ultrasound because I have it, have them framed right in my face. That's how I found out I was pregnant. I have a few complications with, you know, health-wise with myself. So I immediately got in with the OB. We didn't re really do an ultrasound until I was about 17 weeks. It wasn't really supposed to be anything serious. It was just a regular ultrasound. But before that, I did go to this little place that I have where I live, where they do ultrasounds and stuff. And basically you just act like you don't know you're pregnant. So I act like I wasn't, I didn't know I was pregnant. But obviously I knew I was pregnant. It was just because I wanted another ultrasound. And I got this ultrasound when I was 11 weeks and five days. Like I said, my next appointment, which was with my OBGYN, we did an ultrasound and I was 17 weeks and three days. They didn't think they were gonna be able to see the anatomy, but they were able to see the anatomy and all his bones, hands and fingers and toes and all of that. Everything was fine. And we also got to find out the gender. I am having a baby boy. I'm not announcing his name just yet. I will announce his name once he's actually here, which is going to be pretty soon. I'm not going to tell you guys my due date either. So life has definitely been very busy. Um, I did the cat and dog that I had, I did end up getting rid of. So I have no more pets. And as you can see, my background is different. I did recently just move literally this week, November 14th, I moved um, on a Monday. So I did not vlog that. Literally, there's just been like a lot of like different things that have been going on in my life that I just have not recorded or thought to record. I did record a video of when I went to this one place. It was basically like a little mini vlog of when I went to this one place and got free baby clothes. But besides that, I have not recorded anything. Life has just been really, really crazy. I did not expect my life to go this way, but it is going that w this way. And, you know, I'm excited and I'm ready for it to be over. Honestly, pregnancy is super duper duper hard. 
basically that's that's how my life has been going the emotions the hormones and everything that comes with pregnancy is definitely a lot and now i'm feeling a little bit better about myself winter time is coming up i already put up some of my de christmas decorations i put up a few of them I do have a few more Christmas decorations that I want to get and so I will probably record that for you guys. I have some other video ideas too that I want to record for you guys. Oh yeah, I did get the iPhone 14 um, Pro Max in the deep purple. That's what I'm recording on right now. The quality is pretty good. I'm recording in cinematic mode. But um, so far, yeah, that's really everything that's gone on in my life. I have started shopping for him. We got a lot of things for him so far. Um, we do have some more important stuff to get for him, like a car seat and all that. But his um, nursery room has already started being decorated. We put up his bed. We still have to get sheets for Grandma did get him a blanket with his name on it. But I will be doing a video like showing you guys like all of the clothes and everything that I have gotten for him. And I'm just so excited. I can't wait to see who he looks like. I can't wait to see if he looks like me or it looks like um, his dad. I'm just like really, really, really excited. He moves all the time. He is a very much a busy body. And I just can't wait to see his little personality. I'm gonna show you guys right now like the different ultrasounds and stuff that I have. This one at the top is at seven weeks and three days. Yeah, seven weeks and three days. This one right here is from 11 weeks in five days and then these ones are when i found out the gender 17 weeks and this one is also 17 weeks i got two different ultrasounds from two different places i do want to get another ultrasound but it's like 200 dollars to get another ultrasound to see his facial features and everything and i'm just like bro do i really want to pay 200 dollars Mm, yes I do but like you know when you have a baby now you're saving and you're trying to work to get all the things that you need so yeah I cannot believe that I'm pregnant it's still so crazy to me it's still so crazy that I'm about to be somebody's mother and yeah basically like that was that's actually very 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 crazy but I am going to show you guys my little bump that I have so this is my bump at 27 weeks my belly button is coming out this right here is from when i had my belly pierced i got a pierced two times and it rejected both times so yeah we get the line the lanegra i think it's called but yeah this is what i'm looking like he's growing my stomach feels oh my god he's right here okay but yeah i'll probably insert some clips of him moving because i do have videos of him moving and kicking that's my life update video thank you guys for watching please like comment and subscribe stay tuned because i promise i'm going to be uploading videos for you guys again and yeah thank you guys for watching bye